and I know it's a couple of days away, but um, what's the mindset you feel like guys got to have uh, after a game like this going into that? Um, it's a win or go home. You know what I mean? It's, um, you know, I feel like we, we worked as hard as we did all season, you know what I mean, to get home court. Just because you have home court doesn't guarantee you're going to win the game, you know what I mean? But we'd rather play at home than play here. So. The turnovers, uh, 22, we had 29 points. Devin had five. I mean, Devin had eight, you had five. What is, was this more of what Dallas was doing defensively, more of what you got? Uh, probably a combination of both, you know what I mean? Uh, we both... You know, I don't think we probably had a game all season where it's both, you know, combined for that many turnovers. But we'll look at the film, see what we got to do better. You know what I mean? I think that's the only saving grace in this situation is we uh, we get to go back home. I mean, you've had bigger guys guard you before, so this isn't anything new. Are they, what's Bullock and, are they doing something in regards to how they're defending you that, that's leading to the turnovers? Um, I got to go back and look at it. Um, I don't know. I lost one off a dribble, threw one in DA. You know what I mean? So, you know what it. Yeah. What What do you make of like the personality of this series so far? That it's been such major swings from whatever arena the games are in. Been in it before, seen it. You know what I mean? The best thing about all these playoff games is you don't carry like a twenty point lead into the next game. You know what I mean? Each game is a personality of his own and now it's down to, to one game, game seven. And just to follow up on the game seven, Dwayne mentioned, uh, I think you played in seven of them in your career. Anything that you quickly flash memory of, of what do you think back to your game seven? No, nah, if I sat here and tried to remember all of them, I probably could, but I'm trying to get home. <laughs> Chris, did you want to uh, did you impart any kind of message to the guys after the game going into this thing, seeing that you do have experience in game sevens? No. <laughs> Honestly, no. I don't like to be that dramatic. You know what I mean? We got a couple of days, finally. You know what I mean? Finally not playing every other day. You know what I mean? We got a couple of days to let this sit and let this marinate, and uh, we'll talk, man. But at the end of the day, it's basketball. <laughs> it's not life-threatening or anything like that. So guys will get ready, and we'll be ready for Sunday. Chris, with the amount of live <clears throat> ball turnovers, can you describe how hard it is to play on your back foot like that throughout the yeah, game? Yeah, it's tough. It's tough. Uh, it's, I've always said turnovers like interceptions, you know. So when we turn the ball over, they get in transition threes. Once again, the other guys got going, and uh, we didn't see that movie before. Chris, it looks like <clears throat> you were bringing your hand out on the way out. Are you all right? Yeah, I'm cool. And with that extra day, I know you guys like to bounce back from losses and stew on those. With we'll take the extra day. day. Trust me. You know what I mean? That other series got, what, three days? <laughs> Trust me, we'll take the extra day. <laughs> Thanks, Chris. Yep. Thank you, Chris.